Hi there, I am Harpreet. I'm a hypnotherapist and a sound healing coach. I wanted to share with you a set of personalized frequencies or tones that are based on my voice sample. So essentially what I do for clients is I take a voice sample from them saying an affirmation and I run it through a very sophisticated algorithm software um, that was developed by quantumsoundhealing.com. And what it does is it detects from all of your energetic bodies, your physical, emotional, mental, spiritual, any balances or imbalances that are happening. And based on what it detects, it creates a set of frequencies or tones for you to listen to, to help balance you out. So essentially, if I can generalize, the tones help you release any fears, anxieties, or stress that you've been carrying for a really, really long time. And it's like you're an onion and you're every time you listen to your tones, it's like slowly peeling away layer by layer until you're tapping into like your truest potential and um, connected to the divine being that you are. Some of the benefits to listening to your tones includes, you know, uh, developing clarity, feeling more relaxed. It helps your nervous system uh, feel more relaxed and calm. Um, you know, for people who are more creative and maybe want to develop more of a logic, uh, rational side to their life, you know, it, it creates balance between the left and the right hemispheres. Um, if you're somebody who is finding yourselves, you know, always feeling busy in your mind, um, it'll, it'll bring you down from like the busy brain waves to feeling a lot more relaxed. Maybe you consider yourself a beginner in meditation and you want to become mastery at meditation. Tones are a great way to get into that mindset a lot quicker and a lot sooner than to spend years and years and years and years getting to that level. If you are somebody, and I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that are, you know, struggling and um, feeling anxious and fearful in the situation that we're right now, that we're in right now with being on lockdown and quarantine and you know, we have all these health related um, situations coming up and economic as well. For some people who consider themselves to be sensitives or empaths, you know, it's easy to like, you know, watch the news and then tune in and like just pick up on all the fear and the sadness and the intensity around you. Now, these tones are a great way to help lift some of that heaviness off so you don't always have to feel exhausted and drained. Um, cause you know, we got ourselves to take care of as well. Right. And for some people we have children and families to take care of as well. So everybody's going to have a different experience as a hypnotherapist. My, I'm really drawn to, uh, working around and processing emotions and how they're connected to our memories. And, you know, these are things that we carry with ourselves day in and day out, whether we're aware of it or not, it's, you know, our experiences make us who we are. And I, I really do believe, um, you know, when we're in a certain state, an emotional state, we're, we're emitting a certain energy to, you know, everyone around us. So if you're grieving the loss of a loved one, for example, you know, grief has a certain vibrational signature compared to joy or excitement or anger. So let's say that years and years ago, when you were much younger, you had a, you had a, an experience that left a really big impact on you. What happens is when something impacts us, we internalize it and it becomes a part of us in all of our energetic bodies. And like on, so we have basically cellular trauma that's like lodged in our energetic bodies, playing a role in how we show up in the world. So for example, let's say, I don't know, let's say something happened when you're much younger and it resulted in the family feeling really disappointed in you. From that moment, and you know, especially as children, we don't, we don't really understand what's going on in the world. We just absorb everything in our environment. Um, these, uh, the projections from other people, our parents, teachers, you know, TV, our siblings, our friends, these things that we listen to and take on, on some deep level, we make agreements with some of these stories essentially so if you did something that had other people looking at you like you were a failure you know that's something that you could still be carrying with you today and you know throughout your relationships and from job to job 
you know, if you're trying to better your health, you know, and you can't seem to stay on a diet, for example, like you might just keep feeling like a failure because our brains are designed to do that. You know, as, as amazing as our brains are, you know, I think it's really important to learn how to work with them because our mind is designed to help keep us safe, you know, and um, so some of our fears are stored so that we can reference a time where oh yeah that time I you know I felt like a failure it's going to create experiences where you feel that again and again um so again it's great that your brain is keeping you safe it's doing its job that's awesome but then there's times where you know if you're in this state where you're living out this story without realizing it there's no room for growth there's no room for for truth you know and so um, again listening to these tones that are based on your voice sample help release that cellular trauma slowly bit by bit so that you can you know reach your truest potential so what I'm gonna do is do a super super quick like 30 second breathing exercise to help you get relaxed and comfortable and the voice sample that I'm gonna share with you um, involves the affirmation I am calm strong and centered I trust that I am safe eternally and what I'd like for you to do if you're interested is to just find a comfortable position and if you have headphones it'll be more of an effective experience um, just find a relaxed place and just listen and just try to relax you can listen to this before you go to bed or first thing in the morning it doesn't really matter um, don't listen to this while driving or operating heavy machinery. That's really important. And the tones are about 24 to 25 minutes. So I'm going to, I'm going to be off screen and it's just going to be the tones and like a still picture. And the picture has nothing to do with the tones. I just want to create, um, a picture. Like if you decide to stare at the screen while listening to the tones, that's totally fine. Um, I want, I, I like, pic I like images that are like still and, and centering. So now if you decide to listen and you get all the way to the end, uh, give yourself some time to come back into the room and slowly just come back and, you know, feel into your body and become more aware, get grounded, maybe go for a walk if that's what you need, do what you need to do. And so when you're ready, just find a comfortable position, either sitting or lying down. And just take a nice deep breath in through your nose and exhale out through your mouth. And again, take a nice deep breath in and exhale out through your mouth, letting all stress and tension go. And allow yourself this time to just relax. Allow it to have this time for you. And just try not to focus too much on the external world and just give yourself permission to be within yourself. Allow yourself this time to connect within. If there's any tension in your body, just breathe in into that area of your body and just relax and exhale, letting that tension go. Mm -hmm. 